when they get big they register a lot of trademark and most people don't even consider register one In this video i'm going to show you how you can get information of the trademark electronic arts we're going to look what kind of trademark they have first thing what you're going to do is look up what kind of company it is second thing that we're going to do is we're going to go into trademark engine and the trademark engine we will look up for the trademark that they have so let's go to google you see this is google what you're going to do right now is look up some information about electronic arts so we have here electronic arts it's company e-game company they make video games as you can see here so interesting e-game really interesting company so we find some information about it on google but um we're gonna go we are not going deep in that what the structures of the company just want to know what kind of company it is and we have an description of it stock price interesting so yeah good to know what we're going to do right now is we're going to go to team view that's trademark engine i made a video about this how it works if you want to know more about it feel free to look on the playlist so you see here we type the trademark in what we're looking for and we're going to wait for the results and based on the results we know what we can use or not so you see this is results and interesting what you need to do is look for trademark that is uh, register so we have here 100 if you want to know what trademark holder is you will just look for the name here so what you're going to do is we're going to look for the name and you see electronic arts incorporation they have a lot of company that owns those rights so technically this saying that this is a big company and a company is in you can find it in a lot of countries so these are the trademarks we're going to look at the some so let's open some in a new tab this one look also interesting and uh, let's see what we can find nine like class nine is a game so we're going to look at this one also so we're going to look at three and see what will happen so this is number one electronic arts register state since 2011 this is the name you see the font also special font individual trademark 41 and this is in china let's see if i'm correct japan sorry this is in japan so made it in japan application name is representative this is the company that represent them in japan so really interesting and it's just only register and it's only registered for one class i cannot translate this maybe google can translate let's see and translate it in english goods and services sometimes could not be translated so yeah too bad google translate so this is the trademark one of them and another one for that, that company is this one this is also this is in korea you see that here let's see if this one can be translated so we can see what kind of trademark yeah class 42 a business to provide download computer software so correct online game service business marketing service business so you see 42 41 interesting and the thing is too bad it's in uh, another language i wanted to have one in english but maybe I should look in the for one in English. This is another one, Electronic Arts 9 and uh, 16. And this is in Ireland. So computer game software, real uh, instructional manual. Interesting. 9. So yeah, this is in Ireland, this is in English. And uh, what can I find here? Correspondence address and representative FR Kelly. I think this is a lot of uh, interesting. So if you go back. Canada they also represent in Canada so we can open it. it this doesn't mean that they have a company there it just means this as a that they have a representative in that country so they are representative in all so you can find this company in a lot of country so we're going to look at the last trademark electronic arts interesting nice language Canada CPIO CIPO Colombia yeah representative interesting so you see this is another trademark that they have so technically they are a gaming company and they register a lot of trademark but this review i wanted to show you that a lot of company when they get big they register a lot of trademark and most people don't even consider register one why do they do that because they want to protect their name in the country when someone tries to misuse their name 
So if you are developing a game and you want to know more about trademark, feel free to follow the playlist. Look at the videos, ask questions if you need on Discord or ask me direct question. Doesn't matter. But for me, it's important that you get to know how to use your trademark and you know what you should do and what you should do, shouldn't do. So if you look at this, okay, look at this closely. When you have a company startup, consider for yourself, is it important to register a trademark or not? So that, that's about it for this video. If you have questions about this, feel free to contact me on Discord. If you're new to this channel, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.